Hello, Becky. What are we doing today? Today we're making some delicious chili. We have all the ingredients set out already, ready to go. Everything's been measured and prepared, and we've mise en place it all. So let's turn on the Instant Pot. We gotta push saute. Here it is. Um, get it hot and ready to cook our vegetables. First step, add two tablespoons of butter and one tablespoon of vegetable oil to your Instant Pot. We need a stick. Hook everything in the dirty sink. One ramekin down. This is gonna be boring. Oh, it smells like butter now. Okay, I think our oil's hot and our butter's melted. So time to add our onions. We have one medium yellow onion. Diced up. Uh, we're also gonna add one green bell pepper. Nope, that's a full blown up pepper. What? This is the biggest one. That's a poblano pepper. We added the whole poblano pepper. Not a bell. Do you think that's gonna be spicy now? No. Where's the jalapeno? Is this jalapeno? Is this full jalapeno? <laughs> so there's no green bell peppers, I lied. It's all spicy peppers. I don't think poblanos are very spicy, Becky. Oh. Okay, so these are sizzling. I diced the onion, so that's why there's a big strip of onion there. So we want these vegetables to get a little soft before we move on to the next step. This one just literally jumped out of the pot. Oh, it looks so yummy. You got your other pepper. Oh, yeah. um, this is the habanero. It's the spiciest one. We put in, just have it and remove the seed. You put it in so all of its juices get absorbed, but then you remove it. Because you don't want to eat that. And you want to be careful when you're cutting it, because it's very hot. I think we've sweated our vegetables enough, so mm. I'm going to take this habanero out. you got all of its delicious flavors in the pot. Did you want to eat this one? I do not. Okay. What do we do with it? Oh, sad. It's what a waste far. of food. Okay, right, now we're going to add our garlic. This is about a tablespoon. A tablespoon of garlic. Mix that in with your onions and peppers. Good. Okay, next up, we're going to add our ground beef. This is two pounds. Um, obviously, if you want to make a vegetarian chili, you can add carrots. Mm. Mm. It struggles. Ooh. So much meat. Okay, we got it. I'm gonna crumble it up, brown it. So struggly. What's the uh, fat content on your beef here? Um, 100%. 100% what? 100% loaded fat. Got it. 
I think this particular one is an 80-20. 80-20. Because that's what was on sale at the store. You told me this one wasn't on sale. Oh, shit. Yes. We're rich. <laughs> well, now this just looks weird and pink. It doesn't look very good anymore. This is a workout, too. This is where we're going to need some speed up. Easy. Oh, it's brown already. That was Looks fast. good, right? A little bit brown beef is now brown. So we're ready to move on. What's next, chef? <laughs> Beer! What kind? Uh, any kind. Any kind that you like. Yeah, this one smells like beer. How much do you put in? A little bit? A lot of it? More? How thirsty are you? It's probably good. Mix that up. Alrighty. Add sauces? No. Add the tomatoes. We got one can of diced tomatoes. Ooh. Got a can of Rotel. More diced tomatoes and green chilies. The original. Original flavor. And we got some Hunt's tomato sauce. No salt added. I don't think the salty part is necessary. Not important. Oh, that's actually worse. Oh, there's just meat bits in there. Mmm. Need a smaller spoon to scoop that out. House is looking a little dirtier though. I think you got some everywhere. You're looking tomatoey now. Looking chilly. It's very Christmassy, I guess. Christmassy. Well, maybe not. Wow. What else? I don't conform to celebrating. Um, next step is to add our taco sauce, poison sauce, and Worcestershire sauce. It's all been mixed up in here. This is so much more convenient when it's already pre-measured for you. It is. I'm gonna thank the producers later. <laughs> Sauces. Spices. Yeah. Good. Mix it up. We're getting close to the end. Phase one. <laughs> Dumping everything in a pot. Season with salt. Okay, well, we put all of our seasonings into a little cup. We've got cumin in the bottom. We've got cilantro leaves, Italian seasoning, seasoned salt, salt, <laughs> the white chili stuff. powder, um, who cares? Put it in the pot. Oh, Creole seasoning. That's the other one. Mm. Can you make a chili without cumin in it? <laughs> yes. Incorrect. <laughs> All right. Last thing to add, some beans. You can add whatever kind of beans you want. We're going to add today black beans, great northern beans. Great, they're just white beans. The white beans are from the north, I guess. We got some dark red kidney beans. This seems like one can too many. Mm, beans are yummy. And now what? Uh, now 
we just close it? Maybe mush it down? Don't mix them in. Mush it down a little. Um, now we're ready to seal it up. I think you need to change some Instant Pot settings. All right, let's check the settings. Um, okay, we've set our valve to sealing. And now we want to select the chili setting on the Instant Pot for five minutes. Um, looks like we've done this before. Looks good to me. Now we just wait. Boring. Let's just wait until this valve goes. How long do you think it'll take? 10 this minutes? This is what you're watching for. This will pop up when it's sealed, when it's pressurized. The time's up. Did you already release it? No? All right. Let's let the steam out. Well, that's always being annoying. Yeah, it's true. Three hours later. the final step. Final step, let's add some better than bouillon chili base. Uh, four tablespoons? It's like cheating. Cheating delicious. Was it four? Heaping? Um. <laughs> Was it three or four? but I think you've already put those in. You go a little more. Tell me heaping. Heaping means a little over the top, not an entire teaspoon <laughs> on top. Doo -doo. And then when you're done, it looks like this. Or it did that one time I cooked it. How about now? Sprinkle some fake cheese on top. Ew. You don't want to eat real cheese. <laughs> That's about it. Maybe a little more. Do we have to wait till July to eat it? <laughs> okay, good. It's chili for today, for tomorrow, and the next day in one dirty pot. <laughs>